Hello, uh, my name is Zach Hater, and in this video I'm going to be walking through my experience with the amazing liver and gallbladder flush. I've done this video in two separate halves. Uh, the first half is the first flush that I ever did using this protocol, which I did in January of 2019. Uh, Later on in the video, the second part is me doing the flush again for the second time, now in July of 2019. So, there we go. Hey there. So, um, <laughs> it is now Friday, which is day six of the preparation. So, yeah, I went from Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and now Friday, so this is the sixth day. Um, this is the first part of the, uh, <laughs> the major part of the flush. So for the past um, about six days, including today, I've drank one of these f between waking and no later than 6 p.m. It's just, uh, yeah, um, organic apple juice. And the idea of this was to soften the, gall the gallstones. Um, here's the other ingredients. So I've also got, yeah, so this is all of it here. So it's now seven o'clock. Um, I did two more colonics and, uh, <laughs> which was nice. So now I know that my colon is like ready to go. So what I've done is I've just kind of like set out, um, the, uh, Epsom salt and water part of the solution. So four of these, all four of these cups, so inside is just um, water with the Epsom salt, you can't see the Epsom salt, but it's a tablespoon of each, tablespoon of Epsom salt in each, along with um, 180 millilitres of water in each, so that's good, and now it's seven o'clock, so I'm going to drink the first one, let's see how this tastes, got to deal with it, bite the bullet, you know, this is for the rest of your life, one day for the rest of your life. <laughs> Mm-hmm. 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 Oh my god. So that's all of it down. <laughs> the first lot. It tasted um bitter. Oh the one granule that you left I just chewed on. <laughs> oh. Oh my god, it's nine o'clock. Well, we may as well do the next. Oh, okay, All right. Mm. Mm. Okay, so whew, it's now quarter to 11 p.m. So it's been, yeah, it's been five hours now since, uh, since I did the colonics. And since I did those two colonics back to back, I've had probably about nine bowel movements. Um, I just had one a moment ago as well. I think every time, because those two Epsom salt water uh, drinks that I had as well, I think that added to the uh, <laughs> to the wateriness and the whole kind of triggering of the uh, bowel movements. Whew, feeling a little bit, feeling a little bit kind of weird. I think it might be the Epsom salts, but I'm not sure. Also because I'm kind of well fasted as well since eight hours ago or something, so it might be that as well. It's what's the time? Yeah, it's 10.41, so in 19 minutes time at 11 o'clock, I'm going to be doing the uh, the clinch point, so um, yeah, here we go. It's uh, yeah, good, yeah, looking good and juicy, and they smell awesome. The full amount now, and uh, actually 101.95, but a Nutri Bullet jar with a lid. Grapefruit and olive oil. <laughs> it is a list of 
Jeez. Ah, the moment of truth. There we go. Olive oil and the grapefruit juice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this stuff's going to be interesting. So, after like not 20 shakes, but more like 50. Um, it has turned into what it was said in the book to, and uh, it's now 11 p.m. <sighs> Here it is. It's quite nice. I wouldn't go out of my way to drink it, but that's, that's all right. It's all right. Not too bad. Not too bad. <clears throat> right. For me, lights off, lying in bed, 20 minutes, go. Okay, so now I've done the, uh, the 20 minutes and, um, yeah, I didn't really feel too much going on in my liver. Um, like some people said they can feel the stones moving about and stuff. And I did feel some some things going on, but yeah, um, I just had to as soon as I finished the twenty minutes, I had to go again to the toilet, and uh, some more brown water came up. Okay, so it's now seven a.m. I've just woken up. I really need to go and sit on the loo. Um. I can feel like some watery bowel movement wanting to come out already. So this is quite a big moment. Um, I've got a bucket. <laughs> I just uh, I just went to the toilet. Um, what came out was that um, uh, it was just basically brown water. Yeah, I looked, swirled it around, and there was probably about five small greenish stones. Okay, I'm actually having quite a hard time um, I'm down to the last bit um, in the cup and it's the last bit that I need to chuck back and swallow and I'm just even tasting it is just kind of making me wonder if I'm going to puke it up okay so I managed to get it down alright now I'm going to go sit up right somewhere this is kind of cool I can literally heal I can feel and hear my liver going alright <laughs> so to be fair it might not be my liver but um whatever it is it's uh, something's happening so <laughs> turn off or look away from this part of the video if you don't want to see this and if you're a bit squeamish in that way of which if you are i wouldn't blame you so this is the stuff that came out uh like when i first woke up about 40 minutes ago um, ready, three, two, one. I can make out, as you can see, the kiwi seeds, the little black bits. Um, but I can see what looks like a few little green stones. Quite really smells. Yeah, there's the stones. There they are. Yeah. There's a couple. There's a few. Just... I've been awake now for an hour and ten minutes. I had that first brown water come out, um, like when I first woke up an hour ago. And uh, just now I've had another release. Now, the second one that I've just done now at ten past eight, uh, <laughs> it's come out and it's much more green, dark green, just like liver bile was supposed to be. That's the old stuff, that's the new stuff. I can see all of the gold stones, there's loads of like green ones. Um, okay, so um, it's now 8.40 a.m. I've got about another another half an hour until I, uh, until I wanna do the fourth cup of Epsom salt. I've had another expellation of uh, stuff and I'm now really happy. There's a lot more stones that have come out now. 
um, still feel a little bit. Oh yeah, it's um, yeah, it's five minutes to nine, and I've done four bowel movements since waking up two hours ago. So yeah, there's a lot of stones. It's now five past nine, and I'm deciding that now is the time I'm going to drink the fourth and final part of the Epsom salt water solution. It's now quarter past 11. I just had another uh, bowel movement. Um, I'm amazed at how much water has come out of me. Like, quite shocked actually. Um, decided that I'm actually going to do it. I'm going to, instead of just drinking the store-bought apple juice, I'm actually going to juice two or possibly three mangoes and use that for, to break my fast. Okay, so it turns out that uh, mango doesn't juice very well. <laughs> But I still got a nice bit of juice. This is the best thing. And now these are all the cholesterol based ones that actually float. And there's probably a lot more underneath that um <laughs> at the bottom that are sunk to the bottom that are much more calcified, but I haven't really got to those ones yet, so Okay, so that flush that you just saw was the first one that I ever did and was done in January of 2019. It is now July of 2019, so seven months on, and I've just completed my second flush. Hey, I'm really, really happy with the results so far of this second liver flush. I have, a, I have literally right now, I have no solid food inside my digestive tract which I do feel has helped because now it is the morning of the Saturday of the liver flush day six and okay now I'm much happier with this one because I can see the stones and there's no like there's no like solid feces or solid chunks of like digestive food in amongst this, it's literally all stones. So all of these that you can see, all these like, all these green spots, are all liver stones. Believe it or not. Now I'm just gonna pull one up for the purposes. I also wish to add that when this, this was the first flush, so this was the first expiration, and when I move it around, you can just see there's just loads of, um, there's just loads of the stuff in there. It's just prolific. I wouldn't actually call them all stones as such. They more look like, like shards or flakes of cholesterol that have just been sat in the liver for X amount of time, and... They are now out. <laughs> this is the second of the morning. And there's loads just yeah, there's yeah, there's loads of them. Yeah. Um Yeah, there's loads of little stones. Can't really see any solid ones, like hard tan ones like they say about. But yeah, there's loads of stones there. So, this is the third one. There's quite a big one in here that you can see quite clearly. That one there. It's quite a big one. These are mostly stones, especially along here. You can see they're all little. I don't even want to call them stones anymore. I want to call them congealed lumps of toxins and waste. So, 
yeah, I'm feeling pretty good right now. I've just taken my last piece of Epsom salt with water. Um, I haven't had it, I haven't had any more bowel movements. I've had three this morning that have involved stones, and uh, so far so good. I can just feel my liver kind of doing stuff right now again. It's like like little noises coming. Um, <clears throat> And so now in about two hours time I'll be having some fresh fruit juice, which will probably be grapefruit, because that's the juice I prefer to break with right now, and also then strawberries following that, and then later on I'll probably have some kind of like vegetarian meal involving lots of spinach, <laughs> uh, and good things will come, so there we go. I just I just want to go back to the second and third flush because this is the second and third flush combined. It's like it's got a layer of bile on top of it, so it's it's like the stones aren't really floating through it as such, but they're all under there. There's loads of them, like underneath the surface. There's loads of stones. But there are plenty of them, and you can just see them there, all floating, or just beneath the surface. Loads and loads of them. It feels great to have them out. And so, for the end of the second flush, it's going to be some freshly squeezed grapefruit. So, <laughs> good stuff. 